Hello everybody, today we're looking at plus one. So this problem asks us to increment a number by one. Um, but the catch is that uh, each place value is separated by a comma. So this is one number. The number is 123. And we have the ones place, the tens place, and the hundreds place. So if we are adding one, we just need to add one to the ones place. However, if the number is nine, then we need to do something different. And so already, because they tell us that it is ordered from the most significant to the least significant, and we're adding the least significant number, we should start from the least significant number, right? So we need to uh, go from go from right to left with a for loop. Okay, so that's what we need to do. And as you can see, if the number is less than nine, so if we can successfully add one without it turning into a 10, then it's safe to increment. So if it, if the number plus one does not equal 10, then increment that number. Else, um, change the number to zero and um, um, basically um, we need to put put a one in front of it. So that's that's all that's it. That's all we need to do. So first um, let's go from right to left. So when we do this inverse for loop we need to start with our pointer at the last number. So digits dot length minus one because the length is different from the index and then while i is greater than or equal to zero, which is the first index, we need to move it to the left by decrementing it. And so now um, we have done this first part. So now um, if the number at that place, so digits i, um, if digits i plus one does not equal 10, then it's safe to increment. It's safe to increment in that case. And since we only add one number, we can then return digits at this juncture. Um, else, what we need to do, um, so if um, if we cannot successfully add one without it turning into a 10, that means we should set um, digits i should be set to zero, and then we need to digits dot unshift, which pushes a number onto the beginning of the array, one. And then we can return digits. So what do we have here? Um, if we're we're only adding one one time, so um, if the number on the far side over here is not nine, basically, 
uh, we can add one to it and there's no problem so we increment it and then return it um, we return the entire array um, else um, digits i is set to zero and digits dot unshift one so can we do this inside of an else statement let's see what happens why wouldn't we um, and why wouldn't we return why wouldn't we return it right here okay alright I guess it all checks out um, so I guess we have a wrong answer so Control Z, 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 Control Z. Submit. return digits uh, so we don't want to push one until we're sure that the next number is also not nine yeah that's it so we don't want to return one until we're sure that the next number we we don't want to add one to the front of it until we're sure that the next number is not nine so we need to go through everything and if it if plus one equals ten then incre if plus one does not equal ten then increment that number and then return it um, otherwise if it does equal nine add a zero and then we have to continue to the next number because we're not necessarily sure that plus one with the next number is not ten so that's why we need to so can we put this as a, put this in the else statement trying to make this normal yeah okay okay so this is my final final answer <laughs> it looks good right for loop if else return stuff that's a real solution okay everyone have a nice day